Hello and welcome back. Today I've got another £250 worth of 50Ps to hunt through. So we're looking for some commemorative uh, 50Ps, although those are more than face value. So we're trying to fill up my little collection book. So it's only two to go now. We've got Q Gardens. And that is Olympic Boxing, which is fairly common Olympic. Um, and then Olympic Weightlifting. Uh, wrestling, sorry, not weightlifting. Which is a fairly uncommon Olympic. We then get onto the more recent ones. We've got loads of these Beatrix Potters, so fingers crossed we find something new in this video. So let's get into this bag. So we'll open the first bag in real time. I can show you what we're looking for. Right. So shield there is the years 2009, 10, 11 and 16 that weren't minted for circulation um, so we'll keep that off the side to hunt through later there's our first commemorative though Mr Tiggy Winkle 2016 is a fairly common one then we've got Britannia we'll keep them off the side as well because we're looking at the year 2008 which is a low minted year other than that we're looking for commemorative coins or Olympic coins ideally those two that we're missing Maybe we'll get lucky in this bag and get one of them ticked off. Looking great so far, though. Ah, oh, there's our first, uh, our first dictionary that is. So we see that one most often, and we've got a little counter that was made by someone in the Discord, which I really like. Just to count, track how many um, dictionary coins we get. So what we'll do now, we'll speed up until we find anything. We got Tom Kitten there. This is one of my favourites. It's from the 2017. God, it looks weird doing that, doesn't it? Must be the lighting. Looks like it's melting. Um, and my favourite from the 2017 Beatrix Potter set. Always have to see that one. There's our second dictionary for the counter. Commonwealth Games there, so we see that one quite a lot there. Roger Bannister as well, we see that one a lot. That's going to be different, isn't it? 2012 Guernsey. God, that's really nice condition as well, isn't it? Can't believe how shiny that is. Well, that's one to keep. Oh, there's our first Olympic, cycling. Fairly common one, but it's always nice to see Olympic coins. Ah, I forgot to mention, I do have a little tracker in the corner, just for sort of the coin values. They need to take them with a pinch of salt, because they're very hard to value, um, and they fluctuate about it quite a bit. But I keep an eye on eBay auctions, so the selling prices, so don't look at the buy it now, because people put them off crazy prices. So it's just a little uh, helpful guide for you. Um, but like I said, uh, they fluctuate a lot, so they are sort of semi-accurate as of the point that I edit the videos. Oh, got WWF there. So that's a nice one, more than face value. Squirrel Nutkin from 2016. And another dictionary. Another Tiggy Winkle there.
Benjamin Britten there, another one we see a lot of. Ah, Olympic judo. So that's an uncommon Olympic. So that's always a really, really nice one to see. Beatrix Potter from 2016 Team GB there, another one we see a lot of Jeremy Fisher Ugh. How gross is that? Oh, there's a couple of nice ones. So Olympic gold ball there. Third Olympics, good going. And then another really nice jersey. Is that the one jersey? Was that Guernsey? Guernsey. Wow, look at the shine on that. 2016. Try not to touch the face of it, but... Cool. They're cool. Sixteen's Peter Rabbit. So we're missing. It's just Jemima Potterduck now from 2016. That would make a cracking pull. Benjamin Bunny from 2017. Victoria Cross Medals starts that one.
Oh, we've got NHS there. Bit of green in there. Looks odd. But that's again a fairly common one. There's iron side there, another one we see quite often. And 2016's Peter Rabbit again. Another iron side there. And Victoria Cross the Meadows. Ooh, it's a bit of a grubby mill in this tower. We don't see that too often. It's a shame it's not in too nice a condition. Oh, there's 2017's Taylor Peter Rabbit. So we've made a set of the 2017 now. Just put your and Puddle Dog to go and we've made two sets. Battle Hastings there, another common one. I'm on to the last bag, so let's have a sneaky peek anything there. No, maybe that one. Let's get into it then. So we've had quite good luck, some a couple of really nice Olympics and those Jersey and Guernsey ones, they just look spectacular. So really cracking to find them. But it felt like we found less today than we usually do, but can't win them all. For those of you that are interested, oh there we've got um, Team GB again. As I was saying, those of you that are interested, I do run a Discord server where we post like pictures of our best finds. Uh, oh my goodness. Another Puddle Duck. Man, I have got some serious good luck going at the moment. Wow. Unbelievable. <laughs> Um, what was I saying? Yeah, so come over and join the Discord if you are, if you collect coins or if you're a beginner, because we can give you some pointers, and it's always nice to see what you guys are collecting as well, what you guys are finding. Um, that really interests me, so come on over, click the link, clink, click the link in the description uh, to join it. So what I'm going to do now is have a hunt through those coins on the side for any key dates. So as usual, no uh, NIFC shields, but we did find one 2008 Britannia. God, look how dirty my fingers have got. That's a lesson. Don't put coins in your mouth. That's disgusting how gross coins are. So, find of the day, it was going to be one of these two. Until Jemima Puddle Dot came out. And I don't see how I can't make that my find of the day. It's just such an uncommon, really sort of rare coin to find. Um, so yeah, I'm over the moon to have that to find that one so soon after having recently found one too. So thank all you to do is thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time for more coins. Bye.